Okay, guys, it's all about RPC, reactive power component. Exactly. Why are you sleeping in class? And I was not sleeping, sir. And tell what is RPC? Come on, Sangeet. Sorry, sir, I don't know. Okay, sir. Tomorrow I will ask you about what I have thought today. That is reactive power component. Uh, everyone should study and come. This will be marked as in Lena 7 for every Lena X. I told you to study and come, and you know do, you don't know a single word of the RPC. What is this? Sorry, sir. No problem. I will put zero mark for your Indian else. So hello friends, today we are going to talk about reactive powder concrete. Reactive powder concrete is a developing composite material that will allow the concrete industry to optimize material use and build structures that are strong, durable and sensitive to the environment. RPC is better known for its ultra high strength and durability. RPC possesses better strength both compressive and flexural. However, at such a level of strength, the coarse aggregate becomes the weakest link in concrete. In order to increase the compressive strength of concrete even further, the only way to remove the coarse aggregate. This philosophy has been employed in reactive powder concrete. So talking about composition of RPC. RPC is composed of sand, 100 to 600 diameter, cement, quartz powder, silica fumes, which is 25% of volume of concrete, super plasticizer and steel fiber. Let's talk about something which we know about the reactive powder concrete. I know some of the properties of it. So, uh, like, it's a compressive strength. It's a factor of uh, linked with the durability of material, which has a maximum value of 200 megapascal. Mm. And the flexural strength has, is up to 100 megapascal. And the water absorption is low, which is uh, Compared, uh, com which is low compared to HPC, that is high performance concrete, and the quality of and this quality of RPC is one of the among the desired properties which we uh, of no uh, desired properties of nuclear waste contaminated materials. And the resistance to chloride ion penetration increases when heat cure heat curing is done, and the heat cure RPC is uh, will show high value than normal cure RPC. The homogeneity of the material of the concrete is improved by eliminating all coarse aggregates. Microstructure of cement hydrate can be changed by applying heat treatment during curing. Guys, we can talk 
about the limitations of RPC. I have noted some limitations of RPC. We can discuss it now. That are the fine sign used in RPC becomes equal to the cosaggregate of conventional concrete. That is one of the limitations of RPC. Then uh, the, the least costly components of conventional concrete are basically eliminated or replaced by more expensive elements. This is one of the other major limitations there. And I have noted that applying pressure to mix and applying heat treatment in the field has got technological difficulties. Since RPC is in its infancy, the long term properties of it are not yet known. And the other are the Portland cement plays the role of the fine aggregate and the silica fume that of the cement of conventional concrete. These are the some of the disadvantages I have noted. Okay. Yes. Now we will say about some advantages of RPC exhibits higher ductility as its fracture perspective is higher. As it is an ultrasound microstructure, porosity and permeability is less and it can be used for wastewater storage facility. As it has increased corrosion resistance, it can be used in aggressive temperature environments. Its superior strength with higher steel capacity results in significant load reduction and limited structural membership. Okay, let's now discuss about the applications of RPC. The first, the first bridge was constructed uh, was a, uh, using RPC was a pedestrian bridge that is in Sherbrooke uh, in Quebec, Canada. Yes, like that, Portugal used it in uh, sea wall angles. France has also used it in building parklands. The Australia has also used it in circular bridges. So these are all some applications. This is so easy, we can manage everything tomorrow. Yes, we can just look tomorrow. Yes, we can definitely answer the questions. So, let's continue our sleeves. Yes, okay, sorry. Yes.